for daily ask reddit r slash ask reddit parents of reddit what is the weirdest thing you caught your children doing if you like the video drop a like and subscribe so you never miss a video my son licked my toe i asked him what he was doing and he said time traveling he was three the original script to back to the future when my son was about 4 he was playing in his playroom. I was on the couch and heard some sounds behind me. It was just us. So I turn and see my son looking up at the light fixtures and whispering. I ask what he's doing. His response, I'm asking all the light bulbs in the house to not fall and kill you. Thanks son. He's truly got my back. Found my kid talking to the hole in the sink when he was 2. Turns out that's where he said God lives. Carry on. Yeah weirdo. X's eldest hoarded cardboard tubes. If asked they were simply for later. The youngest adopted and formed a strong emotional bond with a garlic for about a week. I used to think that a benevolent creature lived in the tub drain. I got this idea that all the water would drown him. So when I pulled the plug from my bathtub I would sit there and swat the water away from the drain so it all went down slowly enough not to drown the good guy few years ago the cinnamon challenge was a thing. Walked in the door to my son with his head under the kitchen faucet gulping and spitting water. He accidentally grabbed the cum in instead of the cinnamon. I mean, I don't think the cinnamon would have been much more pleasant. My boys share a room. They were about 2 and 7 at the time and I walked in their room and found them rocking on their hands and knees singing we are really the we e e e e dogs. I have no ducking idea. Seems pretty self-explanatory. They were the wiener dogs. Packing peas from our garden up her nose. This required a trip to the local hospital emergency room, where the doctor, a dad of several young children himself, thought it was hilariously funny. Soon my wife and I were laughing as well. When my little brother was 3, he's 25 now, he stuck an M&M up his nose. The doctor said to just let it melt. The babysitter was quite concerned when red and then brown started dripping out of his nose. For a while, our family joked that M&M's melt in your nose, not in your hand. The M&M slogan at the time was they melt in your mouth, not in your hand. My mom caught me bringing eggs from the kitchen into my room and sitting on them in a blanket nest, hoping they'd hatch. What she didn't catch was that I had been doing this for a while and would put the eggs back into the fridge when they wouldn't hatch after a few days. I did this too. I also used to put them in socks and leave them under my bed for a while because I thought that would hatch them. I would check on them every day for progress and when nothing happened, back to the fridge they went. I woke up to my 5 year old spraying Windex on the window beside my bed, cleaning it thoroughly, then nodding at me and moving on to cleaning the windows in the next room. I still don't know what the hell was happening. Edit, she told me before bed that it needed cleaned so her cat could look out. The bottom of the windows get smeared because the cats push their faces against it. So she wanted it clean for them. Not my child, but I've caught my sister doing multiple strange things as a child. The two most notable were, I once caught her playing with a bag with yellowish liquid inside when she was 10. She had pulled this bag from the side of her backpack. I asked her what it was, it was her own pee. She had been keeping it in there for days, and once in a while she'd pull it out go play with. I was horrified. When she was 8, she cut off her doll's hair dismembered it and gave it a funeral which she made all of us attend. She went to dig it up several days later, but it wasn't there. She's done many other things, but those were the two weirdest things she did.